If you've watched my earlier prison bus conversion videos, you may remember that I threw down some cash at a store in my area called Rural King and came home with some monster new batteries for the bus. Now, Melissa asked the other day, why do you keep taking off and driving around in the prison bus? But I thought the reason was obvious. I told her, baby, I've got to keep the batteries charged up. But the thing is that I never really know just how charged up they are, as my prison bus doesn't really have a very accurate battery meter. So to keep an eye on the juice in the batteries, I decided to install a very basic meter. Back when I was cutting out the intercom phone system that the guards used to use to talk to each other, I realized kind of the hard way that the lead phone wire was hot and unswitched. Fuck. Which means powered all the time off of that main battery bank in the bus. So I opted to use this old phone wire to power up my new battery meter. With the meter on all the time, I won't have to key on the bus to check the battery levels. And from what I've read on the interwebs, the meter seems to have a very minimal power draw. If it does end up being a power hog and draining the batteries, I'll likely put a switch on it. Okay, so the battery meter I got needed a housing to make it work with the metal walls of the bus. So what I did is I fabricated a basic housing using some three quarter inch plywood, recessing the meter in the wood, and then attaching the meter itself to the wood housing with some zip ties. I use heat shrink connectors to connect the wires for the meter to the old wires for the intercom phones. And then I added a grommet in that hole in the bus that the wires were coming out of that will protect them from the metal edges.
Like I said, the gauge I got is really basic. It just reports the percentage that the batteries are charged. There aren't any built-in USB chargers or toggle switches or anything like that. There are other meters that do that stuff, but the one I got is really simple, and that's what I like about it. Seeing that I was down to 83%, I hooked my charger up, flipped it on, and it is now charging those bus batteries back up to the top. Thanks for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing. You can follow me on Instagram where I post previews of what I'm up to before my YouTube videos come together and over on Patreon where I keep a sort of blog with more written details than you get here. Over and out.